The following is a fan base series. Skullgirls is owned by Hidden Variable, Future Club, and Autumn Games. Please support the official release. There we go. That should put some distance between us for now. I'll need to maybe stir things up a bit more. Perhaps in the main street. Hmm? About here. This is where I heard the reports about the mysterious attacker. Surprised you're in with those lab folks, man. I have a good friend who's an agent for them. He gives me the scoop now and again. Ice cream buddies, huh? How quaint. Don't start. Anyways, I've been doing some thinking about these attacks. Something's been bothering me about them. Go on. This person is targeting both the ASG labs and the DC members and structures, and making them coincidentally meet each other. Which, of course, leads to conflict between both parties. We thinking something else is going on here? What's going on in that head, Irvy? Yeah, it's just a theory. It's almost as if they're being kept out of something. Like what? I don't know. But I have a hunch it's something to do with the princess. Isn't that right? Well? Come out from there. I saw when you jumped down from the rooftops. Man, Irvin, you got some good eyes. I did smell something fishy before, though. Stay alert. Peekaboo. Good evening. No BS. I'll get right to the chase. What's with the stirrup? Why get both these sides to attack one another? You've gone through a lot of effort to do this. Is this just a fool's errand? How about that? A decent detective. Considering the poor job of law and order in the city, here you are fighting the good fight. Private detective, bub. Same difference, but nonetheless. Excellent deduction, detective. I've not been at this long, but already you've managed to deduce my happenings in such a short amount of time. Still a few holes in your logic, though. A minus for effort. So it is just a goose chase after all. That may very well be it. However, I'd call it buying time, if anything else. We can't be having these nasty distractions for our dear ruler when we've got our own special little performance just for her. Princess Parasol! So it is due with her after all. What are you planning on doing? Oh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Stop being coy! Wasting time, Irvin. I'll go for her. Right now! No, Nadia! Man, she's good. She's able to use her body parts in such creative ways. Disassembling the independence and then reassembling them all together. Second nature. Fascinating. Oh well, I can't drag this out any longer. Tell me, just what's keeping you together, Kitty? Forbidden knowledge is kind of my forte. That's for me to know and for you to never find out. You do know what they say about curiosity, don't you? Of course. However, I'm afraid playtime's over. What have I told you about that recklessness of yours? Don't do that again! I had to put in a little bit of effort there. Bonus points for the surprise attack, but you've still got a long way to go, Kitty. I try to impress. She certainly isn't any ordinary nurse, that's for sure. Her connections with her kicks, too. Such impact. You good? Yeah, yeah, I'm decent. But you better tell us what you're doing with the princess lady. Otherwise, I'll personally introduce you to my claws. With extra sharpness this time. Very nice claws, if I do say so. Thanks! Nadia. Right, focus. <laughs> Aren't you too precious? Unfortunately, I don't have time to explain. The main event will be beginning shortly, and I can't leave my two associates waiting in the wings. Plus, it would be a waste of time to tell you. You wouldn't make it in time. Also, something tells me that you'll have your own battles to deal with happening right now. It's a cat girl. We found her. Get Dahlia down here quickly. She's not getting away this time. Shit. Irvin, we gotta move. We'll have to deal with her later. Yes. Damn it. Like I said, buying time. We won't forget about this, nurse. Even if we're too late, the princess will still kick your ass. <laughs> I'm counting on it, kitty. More than you know. Well... Mr. Tom and Ricardo are in hot pursuit! I think. In other words, you lost them. W well At least we know they hang around here! You can't be serious. That was the information you crackheads gave me before I came down to this putrid place. And now you're telling me you've lost all trace of her. I'm disappointed, ladies. I must beg for your forgiveness, madame. We've looked everywhere around, but can't find any trace of her, or the gem. It didn't help that Ricky and Lori were eyeing some two-faced fish tarts down at that de Cool de Boo restaurant earlier. Hmm. 
Sarabella might have some luck if they're heading in that direction along with Tommy. <sighs> it's bad enough, the Mafia being in the state it's in, and now this risky business with the damn labs. Gotta hand it to them. They're smarter than they look. You give them too much credit. Bit convenient they found our secret warehouse pool in their time flat, when almost at the same time, we also found Ben at River King, perfectly placed in the right moment. I smell a rat, or more specifically, a nurse. Huh? Just musing, it's nothing. I'm on my way to report back to Lorenzo. I'll save your necks this time, but when I'm called back out here, you better have some good news, otherwise they're on the chopping block. Yes, we'll get onto that right now, ma'am. Hope you're doing well, Valerie. Give my regards to Christine and Holly. Is it here? Yes. All the readings were pointing to this concentrated area. However, the signs were all over the place. A fault with the tech? Doubt it. Must be due to the Skullgirl's Theonite waves. Then she is here then, or at the very least close by. Split up into your squads and search the perimeter. Yes, yes sir! Adam, you're with me. Oh, right. What's wrong? It's just you never asked me to go with you in a duo, ever. Oh, well, there's a first time for everything. Now come on. Sir, I understand the situation, but you need to keep level-headed. Don't worry. We'll get Umbrella back safely. Yes, I know. Adam, I... Commander, we've confirmed reports. The Skull Girl is definitely in this area. Target confirmed, sir. But... But, sir... What is it, Sergeant? It's... The Skull Girl, sir. It's your sister. What? What is she doing here? Umbrella, what are you doing? The Skull Girl's here. No, no, sis. It's Mom. She came back. Umbrella... Mom's... Right here, dear. M mother? Sweetheart, it's been too long. Uh, how? I can't... You're dead. I saw you die. Father... Killed. I'm sure you must have a lot of questions. Please, Parasol, come with your sister and I. What is... I... I can't believe this. You're not really here. This is an illusion. It's no illusion, my daughter. On the contrary, I'm very much alive. No! Mama. Hmm. Rest, child. All will be well soon. Indeed. T two There's two of them? What foul sick trick is this? Parasol, it's okay. Please calm down. No! No! Parasol! Daughter dear, if you would merely come along and join your sister, all will be explained shortly. I've... I've missed you both so much. Mom! No! You're dead along with father. Even if you are real, you stopped being my mother the moment you made that damned wish. I don't know what bewitching you've done to my sister, but that won't work on me. It seems she's not as weak as we first thought. Hmm. Pity. As you wish, then. Let's see how much you've progressed, daughter dear. This way. You're not getting away. Adam, deal with the other one and save Umbrella. Sir! Be careful! Right, man! This is what all your training has been for! Be prepared for anything! Praise your majesty! It's Molly, keep to the rear. Let me know if Parasol reports back in. Understood. I pray she'll be alright. I just hope she doesn't let that copy get to her. Remember not to aim too low. We're here to save Lady Umbrella as well. Try to get her away from the princess. Yes, sir. Don't be so on edge, Karen. Yeah, I know. But she's just floating there. Our plan is proceeding apace. We no longer need the child. No. No? The pearl. She's perfect. Perfect. What do you mean? Don't pretend like you can't feel her resonating with me. Her potential is too great to pass up on. I see. Deal with these fools, Nancy. And let us return. Are you going to just float there? Attack! Race! Whoa! This should do. Are you done running? My, how fitting. I'm sure you recognize this place. 
The sins of the parents, as it were. It's past as no correlation here. More importantly, why did you kidnap my sister and why impersonate my mother? Who says I'm not your mother? And let's just say your sister had a part to play in drawing you out. And now that we have you just where we want you, you won't be leaving here alive. Your men won't stand a chance. Not if I can help it. Whatever you are, you won't get away with this. I have so few worthy adversaries. Killing you will prove most satisfying. How very comforting. I see sloppiness. Perhaps you're not all there. You'll see when I stab Krieg down your throat. <laughs> Enough! <gasps> Parasol! You... Mother? Disappointing. You failed to live up to expectations yet again. Unpredictable. And now there's no one left to save dear Umbrella. No! Never fear. I'll make it so you won't be around to see her demise. I can't move fast enough. Umbrella! Now follow your sister into the dark! Huh? We're about to succeed and she's leaving the fight? The girl is... Oh. I see. What is... What's going on? It appears events have taken an interesting turn. I hear this, princess. If you want to see your sister, see to it that you make haste to the place under which the everlasting gaze of the Trinity is nigh. That's the cathedral, if you didn't get that, by the way. Not stupid! <laughs> I heard you the first time! Then I must be making tracks. In your case, though. Even with the information, it would be a waste of time to even bother. How do you hope to save Darling Umbrella when you can't even beat yourself? What have I been doing all this time? I thought I could face anything, but when Bush came to shove, I crippled. I can't do it. I couldn't save Umbrella. Damn it. So, Aerosol! Adam? Oh, good. You're all right. Not quite. What happened? I lost Adam. She beat me. Parasol. All my training and diligence for this. I must seem pretty pathetic. No stupid doubts. Turns out they were true. Come on. They weren't true, and you know it. You were caught off guard. The important thing is, you're not worse for wear. You can still keep going. Don't forget about Umbrella. Umbrella? Yes. Sorry. I hesitated there. Once again, I'm in your debt. Thank you. It's no problem. Quickly, we need to return to the troops. It's not pretty over there. Let us return then. I know where they're keeping her. The Grand Cathedral. That thing told me so herself. I see. Just to be sure, I would advise you rest for only a short time, Commander. I'll stay by you for the time being. Thank you. Sir. What of the fight with... The other. We encountered heavy resistance. Your mother was able to decimate entire squads. We had to fall back. Casualties? None dead, but most have been injured. Some more severe than others. Roxy is one of them. She took a blow meant the Panzer Force. Rosie. How's Tong taking it? He's a bit shaken up, but he's fine to continue. Forgive me, sir, but may I continue? Carry on. The Skull Girl also had the assistance in the form of a new party joining the fray. A sort of nurse. Nurse? Could it be? Your Highness? It's nothing. What of my mother and Umbrella? They got away during the confusion. We were more focused on if you were doing okay. My apologies, Commander. I see. Molly, order the wounded to get patched up and sent to nearby hospitals after. Do it quickly, we don't have time to waste. Okay, watch. Easy. Easy. Oh, this is Parsons, sir. Sorry to disappoint, Chief. No, Rosie. This wasn't on you. This was against me. There's some twisted game at play here. I got to save Pansy, at least. That's all that matters. I know. <clears throat> You'll beat those pricks, too. You did well. Something else. That schoolgirl. She could have killed a whole bunch of our guys. But she didn't. Ain't Skullgirl supposed to get minions from the dead? You're saying she didn't want to kill you? Not sure. <clears throat> Can never tell with these supernaturals. But 
there's something going on here. I know there is. Shame I won't be there to see it all the way. Feels like my left side's going numb. Rest, Rosie. We'll get them back for this. You have my word. Thanks, Chief. See you. Watcher, easy. Okay, we'll do it. Call in nearby squads to replace the ones we've lost and keep most in reserve. They're not going to beat us that easily. Yes, sir! Panzerfaust, we're about to move out. Understood. I saw Rosie off before she was loaded in. She took a hit for you. Few hits. One too many. I could have taken them instead. I used to fighting Skullgirls. She wasn't. She didn't. She did what she thought was the best in the moment. Like me, you, or anyone else. She looks out for our fellow soldiers. It was in vain. We were able to get some information. Good information? Yes. Don't blame yourself, my friend. She'll pull through. Sir. And just as she will pull through, we shall pay them back with insurance. Sir. Let's move. Sir, yes, sir! Molly, give me the details on our enemy's attacks along the way. It might give us an edge. You got it. Why did you bring us back here? We could have annihilated them all. You left the girl, too. Hollow words. You were more focused on the girl than our battle. Utter nonsense. If anyone was distracted, it was you. Perhaps your spirit is. Enough! Those ingrates will deliver her. But meanwhile, we must prepare.